Hello, cronies. This is Windskank, again. Today, Captain Corndog is going to do a how-to video for one of my favorite recipes. Great Value Ramen Moonshine. While he mashes in the ramen noodles, I will be putting together a nice vegetable stir-fry. This is an all-grain mash, and requires an Arkansas shit ton of ramen noodles. The starch conversion is done with enzymes from Great Value Contact Lens Cleaner. This is an all-organic recipe, vegan-friendly, gluten-free, and Joe Biden approved. I would also like to announce, we are holding another drawing this month. We are bringing 10 lucky winners here to record a tasting video of the ramen moonshine. This is an all-expenses paid trip. But you will need to ride the extradition bus from Arizona to Arkansas. Expect a three-day ride, and be sure to dress in all orange attire. Okay, let's get on with it. Don't forget to like and subscribe, cronies. Jeez and tap dancing Christ! I can't understand half the shit that comes out of that woman's mouth. That goddamn short bus window liquor needs to get hooked on phonics and learn how to talk. But I'll tell you, you know, if she would just close her legs every now and then, maybe all those damn bats might stop swarming her. But mark my words, if those two damn idiots mess up my house again, making that shit like they did last time, I'm gonna castrate that some bitch, and I'm gonna take that skank and fill her coochie full of concrete. The only problem is, I don't know if I can actually afford that much concrete right now. Idiots. Damn idiots. Hi there. This is Goober Pile. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. This is Cyrus Mason Jar. Goober. Thanks for tuning in this week. On today's video, we're going to feature one of my wife's favorite recipes. Great Value Ramen Moonshine. Nasty shit. For this recipe, you're going to need about 400 packages of any brand of ramen noodles. You won't need the flavor packet unless you want to add it to your shine later on, which is damn tasty. I'm telling you. Nasty shit. This is an all-grain mash. So we're going to need some kind of enzymes to convert the starch to fermentable sugars. No shit. In this case, we're going to use Great Value Enzymatic Contact Lens Cleaner. It has the absolute best enzymes for converting ramen noodle starch to fermentable sugar. Nasty shit. As for the yeast, we're going to use a special secret yeast that my wife makes. With her coochie. And is only available from our <laughs> website. So, let's get on with the show. Damn it. Okay, we're going to start cooking these things up. And we got to move fast because we got an Arkansas shit ton of these things to go through. So, after we get them all cooked up, we're going to stack them on the counter to drain off without drying out. So here's one, here's another, 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 another one, another one, shit, more, 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 damn, I think I'm going to pass out, some bitch. Better not 
me. Is that what I think it is? Holy shit. No! God damn it, Larry, who? You son of a bitch. <laughs> Hello, cronies. God damn! What the hell is that smell? That certainly wasn't expected. It smells like a tuna casserole seasoned with Bigfoot's dick. You should change your name to Stanky Candle. Goober. I mean, Cyrus. He's resting quietly for a couple hours before he continues recording the video. You know, if he wasn't such a pussy whipped little cream pup, that wannabe internet celebrity probably wouldn't have passed out. Shit! While he rests, I will clean up the mess with the ramen noodles, and get them ready for mashing. You bet your ass you're gonna clean that shit up! Otherwise, you two are gonna be living in that goddamn mouse-infested trailer of yours again! Shit! I'm not sure what happened here, but I have a feeling that crazy old bat invited Larry out here to mess things up for us. having some kind of toxic effect and making you delusional. Oh yeah, you also forgot to address him as Lord. I absolutely will not call him Lord. He is a psychopath. A serious danger to the hobby distilling world. He almost blew us up with his microwave stunt. He is a psychopath. When I think both of you are a couple special ed cases and you your goddamn gene pool could use an Arkansas shit ton of chlorine in it. I'm glad both of you are too old to have children. I'd hate to be stuck babysitting them and having to shuffle them on and off of that goddamn short bus every day. <laughs>